Hello there and welcome back to another episode of Noble Fates. So this is actually the first time I record this game in the in the past five months. The previous three episodes that we recently uploaded were old recordings and I just didn't want to, you know, delete them, scrap them. Uh, so yeah, they were edited, uploaded and now we are finally caught up. So whilst I was doing that as well, five months is quite a, quite a while, so I had to do a bit of, uh, you know, self-updating how the game works. And we, as you can notice, we have changed uh, maybe a couple of small things. So the biggest change here is we've got a couple more uh, villas for, for rental. One of them is actually for Baby Dragon for the time being, because he just wanted to have his own cabin and live away from everyone else. We also have a foundation for our perimeter wall. And what I've also done, I've gone around this hill. Actually, let me speed up the time. So I've gone, gone around this mountain because I don't want anyone climbing over and accessing our colony or the paradise uh, through this way. Okay, so there's going to be one main entrance right at the front. And we'll, of course, beautify this wall somehow as well. Not entirely sure just, just how yet, but I'm sure we will. Just outside the gates, we have all the walls. We do have the pasture for our cows. I think we have quite a few, don't we? One, two, three, four, five. And even a wolf. Yep. Yeah. With one of the recent updates, we are now able to tame the wolves. I'm not really, really sure how they're going to benefit us other than, well, maybe in defense, I guess. We can task them to attack the raiders as well. Actually, one second. There is someone that might want to join our colony. Uh, let's take a quick look at you. You are neutral, so no thank you. Um, right, talking about colonists, we actually have two new ones. We've got Bowie and Avli that have joined the colony. When the game came out about, what was it, a year ago? Last year in December, I that was the last time I played it. And it was a short series, but in, in that game, what I realized is the quicker we expanded, the quicker the raids also scaled up. So in this playthrough as well, I was keeping the colony to a minimum because I was afraid, okay, maybe, you know, that's going to affect how big raids we get and uh, end this series very quickly as well. So yeah, that's why the colony was pretty small, but also... We just wanted to make sure we find the colonists that are evil. Okay, Meat. Well, Meat is one of our founders, so that's okay. You can be neutral, but everyone else is evil in this list. I did want to... Okay, I think Michael is going to be the next one we shall recruit after they've had their breakfast and whatnot. Okay, uh, what else do we have? We have a wolf nearby. Someone's visiting us, and we have this lovely little demonic carbuncle that's glowing near our colony and there's two days left i think it's gonna be a raid i'm not quite sure what's gonna happen maybe some demons will climb out and start attacking us who knows anyways michael what are you up to now okay you're st still eating let's have a look inside as well we'll hide the roofs and now we can slow you down just a little bit right so the idea behind this is uh, i felt this is kind of too boxy and boring and don't get me wrong, this is still a bit of a cube in here, but um, yeah, just to change things around a little bit, we are putting those kind of like corner towers where the bedrooms will go, at least for the for the time being. Then we've uh, changed up the entrance as well. It's nice and flush and goes all the way across. We haven't covered everything up just yet, but I'm sure we'll get, get to it. And in here as well, we have this lovely little entrance, stairs that go down. And uh, yeah, it's a bit of a work in progress. Resource-wise, oh, we've got tons of wood. Uh, Poey was actually pretty amazing. Our farming in the previous episodes was pretty poor. But with him joining us as well, we've got octoberries growing now. A bit of cotton here and... I think maybe even pumpkin as well. Yeah, I think corn was the only thing we could really grow. But all right, let's have a look. What else do we do we have here that's new? So the dining area is now right next to the kitchen. And between those two rooms over here, we have another door and a set of stairs that go down. So let's have a look. So with the butchering area, we've blocked this off now. So we can no longer get in here. 
but instead it's it's right next to the the entrance is right next to the kitchen they no longer have to go all the way here then down and then in here it's a little bit shorter makes more sense and then i guess this is more like a pantry on the left hand side we have all the vegetables that are stored here and on the right side i think it's the ready-made meals yes it is and the butchering area is pretty much the same uh right and we do have a couple more oh that's a lot of hats uh, maybe we shouldn't have created a minimum value okay one let's uh change it up i did, didn't realize they're gonna keep doing so many hats for us that's a terrible amount of hats and michael what are you doing okay we've got a few crossbows as well so that's uh that's pretty lovely uh, i guess it's time to check what everyone has uh baby dragon primary your weapon is only 11 do you like building as well you do uh <laughs> so why don't you take this one instead we'll take the bronze axe away oh it's steel hammer okay that's wonderful and we do need to give you a secondary ranching you are actually a rancher so there you go all right uh who's next uh, i think the rest of the items would be fine right steel axe and secondary you do have a crossbow so that's already fine actually let's look through everyone's secondaries first grappling hook uh well it's not really useful is it you do like them however but <laughs> prefer this one okay there you go okay cap crossbow steel axe right meat what do you have short bow uh i guess we're gonna have to make a couple more crossbows now don't we Avli. Ah, oh, let's give you a short bow as well there we go because this one was almost breaking down and with the rest of you guys okay let's give you one michael you are about to join our colony anyways and you can take this one all right and now the primary weapons so let's have a look you got a steel axe which is lovely steel bronze hammer 42 yep that's pretty good oh okay you could use another one here you go and you've got nothing let's give you one of those michael what about you you like the bronze hammer hammer so off you go and wooden which isn't very good let's give you a steely as well all right fantastic so that's all done i think we can increase let's do five five would be lovely and with the arrows as well let's increase you to uh 300 okay uh, we have been going down the levels we've got um our volunteer rooms are right here i think this is where we wanted to do the prison and for mining purposes we've got some bronze over there and we've, we've been mining rock as well and it goes quite a quite a few levels down as you can see and we're still we still keep going let's uh, activate your mining uh, skill as well all right there we go and that's as far as we go right now um <laughs> so it seems because we have started to dig down through the house it considers everything part of our kingdom therefore make, making our kingdom a lot bigger which i feel and think it is not good this uh, probably triggers slightly bigger raids as well so uh, we're gonna have to fix that i think pretty soon okay now with uh, this layout and design oh we got still got some oh these are rental houses of course they are okay so with the building if we go to the structures we get the stone wall yep there we go we keep repeating this maybe a couple levels before we do the roofs here i don't think we need you could use a door however i mean there isn't really gonna be anything crazy up here it's more of a decoration tower oh, these doors are a nightmare nope 
Why did you go all the way down? Can we place you? Very sensitive, it seems. Okay. Ooh, all right. So we got those ones down. We are going to need spiral staircases. How many rocks do we still have? Oh, 600. Uh, right. So maybe something like so, and we can do stone floors over here. And then we have this little tower. Yeah, okay. With some roofs on top as well, it's going to look a little bit nicer. Uh, and less, less awkward as it is right now. Uh, fencing, what do we have? Where are those walls? Oh yeah, store stone, kind of like half walls. There we go. What are they called? Pars? Okay. Uh, and we do something like so. Should be fine, right? I feel this balcony is maybe a bit too big, but oh well. It will do for the time being. Okay, it's just a, just a day left until we find out what's going to happen over there. Michael, sorry, no, Michael, where are you? Ah, you're right here. Baby Dragon, why don't you go and speak with him? Maybe Michael can join the colony. Michael, stop running away. Are you collecting some wood over there, aren't you? Okay, off you go. And we'll um, quickly see if we can promote to Noble. You haven't treated me well enough. Are you serious? Okay. Michael's playing hard to get, it seems. Uh, what's on your mind? Oh dear. Okay, let me uh, just quickly go through this increase his opinion. Oh yeah, it's pretty low. Yeah, I'm just gonna try and increase the opinion. It's gonna take a bit of time, but we'll be back shortly. Alright, so there we go. I think Michael just started to like us. And no, let's do what else? Activate you over there. I prefer medium kingdoms. So do I. Okay, couple more bonuses. Uh, what else? Let's have a look. <laughs> Human skin, don't like it. Me neither. Okay, let's give it a try. We go back, promote to noble. Alright, second try. Yes, alright, there we go. End the conversation, Michael is... Yet again, part of the colony. He did mention that his prestige... Oh, ambition is 161. Okay, that's not good. Michael, you are definitely going to need another room. Uh, let's see, this one's for Cap. This one's for Baby Dragon. Uh, we shall give you to Michael. What about now? 181. Okay, he's going to love us again. Baby dragon, go and get those cows milked or herded. I'm not really sure what you're doing right now, but off you go. All right, so this perimeter wall here is coming along quite nicely. It's not quite there yet. I, I guess we're trying to figure out how far do we want to go with this wall. Uh, not the doors. Let's grab the walls again. Stone. And since we don't want to make this king kingdom too big... I guess we could even do you, let's see, if we leave one, one, two, three, four should be fine, right? Plenty of room indoors. We'll bring you here and actually, yeah, this could be maybe something like this will do for us. We'll leave a little gap in the middle in case, uh, you know, it's it's too long way to go around or something like that. Um, and we are going to do this exact same thing we did on the other hill as well. We just want to dig around and make sure that no one can climb up from here and therefore entering our colony through a way which they are not 
or it is not intended to uh, right, so there we go. Oh, guess that's not gonna work really well, is it? No. We're definitely gonna have a problem here as well. They will be able to walk around. Um, <laughs> okay, well, we are gonna try and eyeball it and fix it this way. So the wall goes into this hill through here and I think that's where we want it. Looks like there's a little cap in there. All right, there we go. It requires three levels high, but that should do it. Uh, we might also wanna, oh no, they can climb up from here. So this will be fine. And let's carry on going all the way around here as well. Okay. Actually, no. Let's uh, leave them be for the time being. They'll get most of it done. Uh, Avli, you want a 12B bed. Oh yeah, your room's actually pretty empty. Uh, let's look at decorations. I know she wants a slightly better bed, but we'll, we'll get to it. So, kind of like a bedside table for you right here. Uh, what else? I think these stone hearths are most likely gonna go out. I mean, it's a bit silly how it goes directly through the room. Um, yeah, they're not gonna have their individual ones, I'm afraid. Okay. Now, other things. There's just a ton of resources all around this place. I mean, it was way worse before. Yeah, it definitely was a lot worse before. They have sort of had enough time already to tidy this place up as much as possible. And look at that, 17 hours left until something's gonna happen over there. Uh, interesting. Oh, you guys are stuck in our colony. What's our food situation? Well, not very good. Select deer. Oh, we... Oh, okay. You're not just random deer. You actually belong to someone. Uh, do we spot... Yes. Oh, no. These are Dixie Wanderers. Anyone else around this area? No animals at all. Really. Where have they all gone? Doe. Okay, if we highlight the two of you, we can hunt them. Okay, there you go. Cow is being hunted. Is it you? It is you. Wolf, can you attack and protect our cow, please? There we go. Oh no, the cow is down. Now they're just fighting each other. Oh, very interesting. All right, he's down. Meat, what are you doing? Cooking. Howie, you're outside there. Maybe you are closest. Right, there we go. What about the, this cow? Are you... You're not dead yet. Cap... Ah, uh, Ray is already healing the... Or treating the cow. Alright. Well, there we go. Winter is over as well. Got a little notification here. Avli learned wooden crates. Okay. Very lovely. Now, this bed... <laughs> this mantle. And slightly higher priority. We would like to... Build another one here. That's hopefully going to be a little bit better. Alright. Just this way. We'll speed up the time as well. Hopefully someone's going to come along and... Here we go. Maybe give you a slightly higher priority so it gets done straight away. It is only nine. Uh, okay. This mantle. We'll try one more time. Alright. Baby dragons come to help us out. And why don't you... Build this wooden bed. 
Abli, you seems like you are cleaning this area up and mining job is also going pretty well. Well, we let's activate your skill so it's going to be a little bit quicker. And baby dragon was just collecting some wood so we can construct this bed. 16, okay. Uh, mm. Oh, this isn't Avli's room just yet. What about now? Beautiful. Whose room is this? Okay, so that's Gap. This one's Poe, Meat. Oh, that's all the bedrooms we have then, I suppose. It does look like so. Insufficient stone. Oh, these are seeds. Uh, right, someone is fighting somewhere again. Did we just lose our wolf? Oh no, this one's ours. Well, okay, let's uh, cut you up. Another cow has joined the colony. Food stockpiles seem to be a little lower. Oh, never mind. You guys are taking a little unintended shortcut. But since this wall section is pretty complete, I think we can enclose you now. Yes, and there is nothing in there. Beautiful. Same right about here. Let's close you up as well. Uh, nine hours left. Okay. Kind of excited to see what happens. Hopefully we'll be able to survive. Avli will activate your skill as well. Uh, seems like we are going to need some stone. Um, <laughs> right, plenty in this mountain here. And the way we are going to do it is I'd like to build this uh, other tower right over here. Bedrooms in here. Hmm. Right, I was initially thinking, well, I wasn't quite sure what to do with this area. But what we could perhaps use it for is either storage or we do have to move those rental beds and rooms over to somewhere else now, don't we? So maybe this could be a good area for that. Okay, we've got the stairs going down from right about there. And this should allow us to do a couple more rooms in here. Oh, well, you look at that. That's pretty perfect. We shall do a couple over here. And that's going to allow us to have a pretty big walkway as well. Okay. Yep. Beautiful. Five hours left. Ooh, okay. Right. Doors, doors. Are these for renting? Yes, they are. Is anyone renting this right now? No. So we shall move you guys. Uh, this should be fine, right? Yeah. Okay, anyone renting this one? Nope. We'll do the same. Bed goes there. What about you? Nope. Alright, wonderful. One bed and the last one. Uh, so just two hours left. Let's see what happens here. What's the time right now? 8.20. Our animals are going to take the first hit. Camp doesn't seem to be very, very happy right now. You need more clothes. Okay. Oh, you've got no pants on. Well, that's not good. All right. That should be fixed now. You're going to feel a little bit happier, hopefully. Yep, there we go. Almost all the way to the top. 30 minutes. And we'll see what happens. Their froth sips want me dead. Okay. Well, who are you again? Meter. Okay, jobs. Unknown, but your orc. Uh, I'm not ready yet. We'll try and get to know them a little bit. Maybe let's have a quick word with him. Okay. Oh. It just disappeared. Oh. Uh, that's a little bit odd. Uh, right. 
So I'm gonna have a quick chat with Meter here as well. See, oh, we got only three hours. Yeah, see if they are suitable for our colony. Okay, I think we've just found out he's neutral. Uh, right, right, right. Let's go back. Decide his fate. Uh, hmm, <laughs> he's not gonna like this. We don't want to capture him. Do you know what? Just go and find some help from somewhere else. Oh, he's not gonna. Yeah, doesn't look like he's gonna be friendly with us in the future. Sorry, but if you were evil, you could have joined the colony, but unfortunately, yeah. Anyways, fine. So I was kind of expecting a big massive horde of demons to start attacking us, but it seems that is not the case. Maybe it's gonna happen in the future, who knows. But the uh, tower here seems to be almost complete. We just uh, are missing some stones. Let's see if we can do the roof, however. What are the options? Okay. Yep, that can go over there just like so. So coming back to our rooms and kingdom size over here. Because this seems to be part of our kingdom. I would like to enclose, I think, uh, maybe we can do prisoners, maybe one more level. This is like the last one. And what we shall do is we shall enter the mountain from somewhere here. Uh, let's see, where would be a beautiful place to... Oh, that means we're gonna have to cross over. Hmm. Actually, no. I think we are gonna go from ground level because I'm not planning to put any walkways. I don't want to cover this area up, if that makes sense. So we'll dig down and we'll see if we can dig in. Okay. You just missed them. All right, off you go. Right, so we'll dig in maybe like don't want to go too far, obviously, either. And this, actually, let's just do it right here. And we'll cancel these digging commands. Yep, just a quick way down. Wait, our set of stairs is actually here. Oh dear. I don't think that's going to work out because this might... Or maybe it will work out. Yep. So then we can connect them. Yeah, let's do it this way instead. We'll cancel these ones on the side. Alright, there we go. And year of 413. Beautiful. Okay, so things are starting to go pretty, pretty nicely over here. Um, these, oh, we have not furnished one of those villas, but that's okay. We'll, we'll get to it eventually as well. For now, what we shall do is we'll just continue mining some stone around the area and we'll try and complete the perimeter wall. Uh, once that is done, we can also complete perhaps this tower and move some bedrooms into these towers instead so yeah that's gonna be the plan for our future episodes thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one